and super, super popular when you go off to the West Coast, but we've got a brand new choice. I don't think, I think it's the gecko that's new this year, right? That's right, the gecko is new. Mm -hmm. And there's your beautiful butterfly, and then of course your dragonfly. This metal wall art is a piece that really tells a story and is indicative of a very specific design style. That's right, Talavera pottery out of Mexico is what was their inspiration. But what Talavera pottery, there's kind of a weakness in that, is the fact that it breaks. It breaks, I know. <laughs> it can break. So what we've got is something that Plow and Hearth has done out of something that they're so good at, and that's a metal sculpture. And then they've been inspired by that beautiful color and the artistry of Talavera painting. And so they created the gecko, and then you also have your choice of the dragonfly and the butterfly, but they all have those beautiful bright colors of the green and the pink and the like maroon and gold and the metallic gold. Really, really bright and beautiful for wherever you would like to put them. Like See, on the she wall went here. directly to beautiful bright colors and I thought she was gonna say beautiful crystal eyes. <laughs> you know, I'm drawn to the glitz and the glam. She's drawn to the color. But I'll tell you what, pieces like this draw you in yes. and these colors take you to a moment and to a place. You know, like if you see Italian pottery or Spanish pottery, this Talavera style may take you to a vacation right. or mentally you know, remind you of a favorite place. But I have to say there's also some wit and whimsy of the gecko climbing up climbing your up wall. On the wall. Exactly. Now I'm going to show you on the gecko that I'm holding right here because you want to know how are they staying on that wall. So I'll turn it around and I'll show you there is a keyhole on the back here, you'll see it behind my finger. So that's what's going to let it stay on the wall right there. And so you're going to hang it up by maybe a screw or a nail, wherever you choose to put it on a fence post, maybe on the side of your house. But also there is real dimension to this. And I'm gonna turn him sideways. Let's see if you can see that really well. He's got real dimension to him, you know. There you go, the three dimension right there, as well as those eyes kind of popping out, his legs, the way he's climbing. And then there's also embossing on the bodies, whether it is our gecko, or our dragonfly or our butterfly. They're really, really textured very beautifully. And you can leave these out. They've been tested to withstand the elements. So feel comfortable that you can put them out to enjoy them. And um, I just think that, oh, you know what? Too, I wanted to let you know that all of them symbolize transformation. Really? So whether it's the dragonfly, the butterfly, and even the gecko, the symbolism is transformation. Interesting. So, mm -hmm. You know, I kind of like the ge like the ge gecko is climbing out of something. Maybe you've kind of been in a trough. Maybe you're starting a new beginning. Mm -hmm. Or maybe you felt like you were the caterpillar and you're creating your new self. Or you've got that luck of the dragonfly and those fairies are flying on your back to your next adventure. Um, I need to share something with you. Five hundred are gone. Gecko and dragonfly are now super, super limited. And I know you love that rebirth of the butterfly. Butterflies have been so popular yes. at QVC. But I'll tell you this, when you work with Nancy, the design teams from Plow and Hearth, they really, really take a thoughtful moment yes. to decide which pieces are going to be um, brought in, but also the reasoning why, the behind of the Talavera artwork. So let's exactly. talk a little bit about that inspiration if you sure. don't mind. Talavera is out of a special place in Mexico, very controlled in terms of the kinds of colors that can be used mm -hmm. and the kinds of you know designs that can be on the pottery. So this is inspired by that because we know that that's really a beautiful way to have you know some certain designs. But we know that you know not all places can use pottery, it's right. breakable, um, it's more fragile. So I love the fact that they've done it in their specialty of metal work so that right. you can use it anywhere and not worry about it breaking. You know, I moved here from Southern California and you look at this, it's a very biophilic design. Um, by the way, gecko sold out. But when you say like the biophilic, the very organic, these are the colors of the mountains and the desert and the watermelon is the color of the sunsets. So it's bringing you into that favorite vacation or making you t remember, you know, a time that you went to that desert right. southwest. Gecko is now totally gone. If you want the dragonfly, um, I only have 250 left and that's it. And guess what sold out? Come here, Nancy. I feel like we should do like a, one of these kind of deals with our chicks and our sticks. I know. Look, they're, they're the, we're the dancing chicks. That's right. Our little chicks. We need a we need a third partner to have those little turned That's legs. Right. I knew these chicken legs were.